Hello guys, my name is uh, Asmarant, and as you can see by the thumbnail, yes, Robert Sada has um, left to go towards uh, the New York Jets. And my thoughts and reactions on it as well. So, um, let me take this V article uh, that I saw first, which was on Sky Sports. And the headliner for it was, Robert Sada, New York Jets, to hire the 49ers defence boss as he becomes the NFL's first uh, Muslim head coach. Which is brilliant for him. Um, uh, I'll read on. Uh, Sada will become the first Muslim to take charge of an uh, NFL team. He guided the 49ers defence to great success over the past two seasons. Jets looking for someone to turn around uh, other fortunes after two disappointing seasons under Adam Gass. Uh, straight under. Uh, San Francisco 49ers defence coordinator Robert Sada has agreed in uh, principle to become the head coach of the New York Jets, making him the first Muslim to take charge of an NFL team. He, replacing, um, he replaces Adam Gass, who was fired hours after a loss to the New uh, England Patriots in Week 17, but concluded two seasons in charge of Gass, uh, in which the Jets went 9-23, to including 2-14 uh, in 2020. Uh, San Francisco fielded a top 10 defence in total yards, 5th rush yard, 7th Oh, sorry, in total yards 5th, rush yards 7th, and pass yards 4th under Sada's leadership last year. In 2019, the 49ers were scored overall in the league in total defence 281.8 yards per game and first in pass defence going on to reach the Super Bowl after losing Kansas City. Sada 41 interviewed with the Jets twice and is highly thought of the, uh, of the 49ers coach Kyle Shanahan. Um, I don't know what's wrong with people if they don't hire, um, hire him. That's what Shanahan said. Uh, I mean, he's a good, um, he, he's good as you get, really. I uh, hope everyone is not very smart, uh, doesn't hire him, so I can keep him, but I'm expecting not to have him. Rejects interviewed Sada and Tennessee Titans offense coordinator uh, Arthur Smith in person. They conducted virtual interviews with Kansas City Chiefs uh, offensive coordinator uh, Eric Benemy, former Sa uh, Cincinnati Bengals head coach Martin Lewis, Panther, uh, Carolina Panthers offensive coordinator Joe Brandy, uh, India Colts uh, defense coordinator Matt Lafosse, uh, Buffalo Bills offensive coordinator Brian uh, Brian uh, Debal, Los Angeles Rams defense coordinator Brandon Stanley, and New Orleans Saints secondary coach Aaron Glenn. So that will become the 20th head coach of the Jets, who have the second pick in the 2021 NFL draft. The Jets, who lost the franchise record. 13 consecutive games to the Open 2020 season have gone five years without a winning record that made the playoffs in 2010. So yeah, my thoughts on it and my reaction when I heard about the news. You knew someone was going to get in, but I wouldn't think it would be the Jets. Thought it might have been a, uh, uh, only with my opinion. I thought it would have been the Chargers, Chargers or the Rams, um, but then. I may be the Eagles, and then I had the Eagles were having going to have an interview with him, but that backfired. But fair play, I'm not angry about it. Well deserved. He he pushed us last year for the Super Bowl. Absolute brilliant defense, a uh, coach. I couldn't agree more. He's always hyped, and that's the thing about coaches and the coordinators. They're always hyped, and he was always hyped. Offense tried to get away. Defense is there. He jumps up and down. You know what I mean? Keep it going. Keep it keep it strong. As soon as it hits the fourth, straight down, and he jumps all over the place. Touchdown all over the place. That's what you want. You want a person always always going, even if you're losing. When you saw her on the cameras, he's always with them, always telling them where to go, always telling them what to do. You know what I mean? He, he's just like that all the time. To him to go to the New York Jets, um, I was shocked, but I'm happy. Maybe they can get something out of it. Uh, maybe Sada can do something with the team. I hope he does. And um, he's really, really good. Yeah, it's just a shock, a real shock. I don't know what we're gonna do. It's been rumoured the offense offense coach might go to the defense coach, but I don't know. Uh, I was gonna record this season, but I didn't because I didn't know if I wanted to do a channel for that. But I might be doing uh, when it comes back in August. Hopefully in August if the coronavirus is sorted out. I will be doing a lot of highlights, 10 minute highlights, 40 minutes highlights, and the full games for you guys in the UK. But yeah. My, um, it, it's just a sad blow. I'm not too angry, I'm not crying, but it is just this what it is. Everything moves around in the NFL. 
Hopefully next season, Bose was back, Jimmy G's in, Kettle did well at the end. You know, it's a shame it was at the end, but he played his part well. And now you've got a lot of uh, a lot of players in the air for free agencies. And now Salah's gone. Who's next? <laughs> you know what I mean? Who's next? Um, oh, it's just shocking. But to say about him, they've got one of the greatest. He might have been in there for like, like two seasons. It don't matter. That two seasons were worth it. Because where we was last year, even though we were lost against Kansas City, gutted. But um, that that's a man that you can trust and put your heart to, and he can he can deliver. Hope like with us, he delivered. Sadly, this this season, he delivered as much as he could. But the amount of injuries, it's not an excuse. There was a lot of injuries. Um, yeah, what could he have done? Seriously, he did what he could, and that's off to him. He played he, best. He, like defence coach going and I reckon he'll be one of the greatest head coaches going and I hope next season we'll be keeping an eye and see how well he goes there um, and that's it guys um, I don't really watch what to say on top let's talk oh well let's talk about the semis as well um, I mean here's the lineup for Saturday and Sunday and there you have it uh, the 2020, uh, 2020 FL playoffs this is a biggie as you were aware we do not want the Kansas City to go through so hopefully the Browns will do it they pulled it off against the Steelers I was shocked as soon as that ball hit as soon as it kicked off and the Browns got it and it was a touchdown from the start uh, yeah, pff, I was shocked but that's that City yep Kansas City I don't want to win um, Baltimore Ravens and Bills I don't know I do not so I'm going to go Bills, Browns, and then I want LA and Buccaneers. That's what I want. That's my predictions. Yeah, and that's it, guys. Um, there's nothing really more I can say, really. Robert Sada does really, really well. Uh, it's a shame that we've lost him, but I hope he does well for the Jets. Hopefully next season. I can, I can see him doing really, really well over there. Not this season, but next season coming in. Um, I will be d uh, doing uh, 10 minute highlights, 40 minute highlights and a full game of uh, the NFL season on the NFL Game Pass and that will be in the UK because there's uh, restrictions and so forth that so I'll try to get to the US but I don't think I can but I will try my best for that season I'll probably do my reactions for the uh, Super Bowl for you guys uh, but until then yeah, I'll see you guys on the next video